Example 10, converting area measurements. So this again uses the idea of um, unit fractions. Um, so we're going to do 930 square centimetres and we're going to multiply that by unit fractions so we can change it into square metres. Now, the important thing to remember here is that what we're doing is we're changing centimetres into metres, but we're changing centimetres squared into metres squared. So um, we'll do centimetres on the bottom because it's on the top up here and metres on the, the top there. And we know that 10 centimetres, sorry, 100 centimetres is equal to one metre. But because we want squared, then we're going to have to do square, the 100 squared there for the square metres and the square metres. And one squared is just going to become one. So our calculation, because we lose our centimetres squared, our calculation is it becomes 930 times by one all over 100 squared so that's going to be a 930 divided by 10,000 so we've got two lots of two zeros because we've got the two zero squared so that's going to become 0 0.093 square meters Another way to do it would be to say uh, 930 centimetres squared times by 1 over 100, because that's metres to centimetres, but because we're squaring them, we've got to do it again. So 1 over 100 centimetres. 930 times by 1 times by 1 divided by 100 times 100. You're still going to give us 0 0.093 square metres. So for the second example, we've got 0 0.4, and that's in centimetres squared, and we need to change that to square millimetres. So we're going to multiply by that. We're going to have millimetres on the top, centimetres on the bottom, but they need to be squared. So I've got 10 millimetres is one centimetre, but they need to be squared. So I've got 0 0.4 times by 10 squared all divided by 1. Uh, 10 squared is 100, so 0 0.4 times by 100 is equal to 40 square millimetres.